of the center. Thanks for checking your weather on fox4now.com. As of Monday afternoon and uh, now Tuesday afternoon, the scattered showers and storms continue for us here in southwest Florida. And as of today, the storms were moving across the Fort Myers Shores area and Fort Myers, Tice, Lehigh Acres, Alva 2, dissipating as it moves off to the east. Now, because of the storms around Page Field, uh, temperatures have come down into the upper 70s and lower 80s from really Fort Myers over to Cape Coral. Still pretty toasty in Naples as we are awaiting the storms as of uh, 4 5 o'clock in Naples. Haven't seen the rain as of yet. 79 degrees currently with a thunderstorm in progress at this hour in Fort Myers. Humidity 74 percent. Pressure holding uh, steady and falling off a little bit from 30 inches. Winds from the east-northeast at 7 miles an hour. This is what's happening. You see plenty of storms firing over the eastern Gulf of Mexico. Not all of them made it into our area uh, this morning, but certainly we still have some isolated storms here and there across southwest Florida. But the flow is from southwest to northeast. Expect more of that as we head through the next uh, 36 hours or so. One of the reasons for the active pattern for us is this frontal system, which continues to sag around north central Florida. And notice this kind of line of storms dipping to the south. That might be something we'll have to contend with as we head into later tonight. Still, I'm not going to put more than a 30% chance of rain or storms into tonight. 74 the low, 80s as we head into tomorrow, eventually getting up to around 92. Southeast winds on the water, 5 to 10 knots, seas 2 feet or less, and a light chop on the bay. Three-day forecast indicating a solid 60% chance of rain and storms each day. Daytime highs around 92 or 93. Overnight lows in the middle 70s. For your latest weather, of course, click on the weather bar here on fox4now.com. Or you can join us for Fox 4 News at 10. We'll see you then.